Hello friends, welcome back to another video tutorial in YQR for AutoCAD. I am Architect Sonu Rai from Glad Studio and in this today video tutorial, I am going to discuss with you how to create text in, in AutoCAD using YQR plugin. So I am going to YQR and you can go to this text content here and you can set your text height by preset text height you can select your any text height here from the list and this one is user dictionary but this will be in chinese language so this is not of our use so i am going to again the text content here and this one is translate text so if you want to translate any text from chinese to english you can use this and now i am going to select this text to translate and you can see this was in challenge uh, language so now it is in elevation so the meaning is elevation so you can translate text using this translate text option and you can see this update text from the list so you can update any text and this one is for input text so if you want to uh, write any text here you can use this input text and now it is asking input what you want to enter so i have entered here architecture uh, and you can see I am going to write our virtual symbol here and now in the text mode is general text you can use this comment text or title text and symbols you can use upper line sign and you can leave by default here and options style name Arial 1 so I have selected Arial 1 you can select Arial 2 Arial 3 and there are so many and you can use Chinese also so I am going to select Arial 3 and you can set the text height also so I have uh, make it 50 mm width factor 0 0.8 just to file left layer name is text yeah, whatever at, uh, layer you are using you can put it here or you can pick from the list and text color and this one is red so you can select any text uh, color here and you can click ok and now it is asking insert point so I am going to insert here and this one is architecture symbol so likewise you can write your text and again again i'm going to hit a space key and i'm going to set this text height to five here and i will click ok and now i'm going to insert point here so this will be in the lower scale so i have set it to 5 mm so this one is architectural symbol so likewise you can input your text using yqr and now it is asking modify any text so you can modify any text also using this uh, command here tte and i am going to select this and now it is asking pick a text and i am going to pick this as a traditional symbol and you can replace so you can write anything here and so i am going to write a traditional style click ok and you can see this text is uh, modified here so it can save your time using yqr and there are so many and you can uh, leave this you can any uh, join any text here so i'm going to select this and now it is asking select target text and next text to connect so i'm going to select this one and you can connect this uh join this both the text here so you can use this one also and next is merge multi-line text so and you can leave this and this one is break text so if you want to break text here i am going to select this and now i am going to select the object and i am going to enter and now it is asking pick the break point so i am going to again break i am going to pick this as a break point and now you can see both are separated here using break text so i am going to next here and you can see text to character you can leave this increment add increment increase text seek exchange content you can leave all this so these are the important commands which i have discussed here so you can use in your uh, ritual project so next i am going to again discuss text other here so you can uh, use this text other to write any new text style so this one is new text style i am going to select this and you can select any text style and you can use this one so i'm going to use this one and i'm going to click and now it is asking select object so i'm going to select this architectural style and i'm going to enter and you can see this all text is uh, style is changed here text style is changed 
and again I am going to y QR text other and you can also use this one set current style or you can update text by style you can use this and I have select any uh, Arial 3 here and you can select from a style list here so I am going to select Arial 4 and now it is asking select object so I am going to select this object and I am going to enter and you can see this is changed to Arial so likewise you can repeat this I am going to hit space bar and I am going to select this one also and I am going to enter I am going to select from list and it is changed to area so this one is text other and you can use uh, change text also change height text height and aspect also and uh, explore text to lines you can also use this and if you want to explore this to line you can select this any text and you can hit enter and you can see this is exploded to lines here so these are the important commands which I have discussed. So you can use this text style in YQR. So this was the topic for the today session. In the next session, I will come with some more interesting topics in YQR. So please like, share and subscribe my channel. Bye bye.